A beloved Berkeley diner shuttered last month amid the strain of the COVID-19 pandemic is now getting a second chance. And KTU Zach Sauce joins us now live from the newsroom with more on who's backing the new Betty's Ocean View Diner. Zach. Yeah, the new owners say they'll be dropping the name Betty, but everything else will remain the same. And they say you can trust them. They're all former managers and workers and the regulars. Well, they couldn't be happier about the news. I think it's great. Outside the now shuttered Betty's Ocean View Diner on 4th Street in Berkeley, a sign on the door letting folks know they'll soon be back. That makes us very happy because this is such an establishment. For nearly 40 years, this restaurant has been a staple in the community. I had had a long history going there. I'd been going there since I was a teenager. Why William Bishop, who managed the restaurant's finances, says he felt obligated to do something when Betty's longtime owner, exhausted from the pressures of the pandemic, announced that the diner would close. I didn't like the idea of something else going there, and also I didn't like the idea of people who had been working there for 10, 20, 30 years of not being able to continue to work there um, for the rest of their career if they wanted to. As for the community. We've had people writing us cards about the fact that the place closed down. We had people leave candles and flowers out on the front door the day after we had closed. So William says he reached out to the building's owner, Denny Abrams. Denny was, you know, I, he asked me how much you would need to get it back up and going and I told him and he didn't flinch. It's an important uh, part of uh, the greater 4th Street. The developer and his partner largely credited with transforming 4th Street into a bustling shopping destination. We designed it. We built it over 40 years ago. We uh, picked the whole idea of having a diner there. And committed to seeing it stay that way, loaning William and his six co-owners, including two longtime chefs, the money needed to bring it back to life as the Ocean View Diner. Hoping you'll have the same kind of vibe and feel, which I would assume because it's the same same folks. That's the plan, according to the new owners who have already started reaching out to all of the diners, former employees. Meantime, Betty's former owner is allowing them to keep the recipes and the names of all of the restaurant's famed specials. William says they don't plan to change a thing. Everybody has their breakfast place, and when they can't go get that same breakfast every morning when they want it, it's, it, you know, it's kind of heartbreaking. So it's nice that people are going to be able to have that again. And if you're wondering when you'll have a chance to savor their famed pancakes and hash again, William says he's shooting for some time later this month. In the newsroom, Zach Soss, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Yeah, really glad to see that they were able to find a solution here. Zach, thank you.